okay so in this question it is given to us that the ratio between the number of boys and the number of girls in a class is 4 is to 3 right so let us start writing also boys and girls the ratio in this class is there are 4 is to 3 boys is to girls right if there were 20 more boys and 12 less girls so I will have to actually know the quantity of boys and quantity of girls to write further equations right so to do that let us now consider that the constant of proportionality for the first statement where it is given that the ratio is 4 is to 3 the constant of proportionality was x in that case the actual number of boys will become 4x and number of girls will become 3x initially 4 is to 3 was just the ratio this is the actual number right now let us go to the second statement if there were 20 more boys if there were 20 more boys there are already 4x boys there are 20 more boys and 12 less girls there are currently 3x girls we are taking 12 less girls the ratio would have been 2 is to 1 which means that the ratio of these two quantities 4x plus 20 upon 3x minus 12 would have been 2 is to 1 right so find the total number of students in the class to get the total number of students we need this constant of proportionality so that we can find the total number of boys and total number of girls right which can be found by solving this particular equation right so let us do that let us cross multiply what will we get we will get 4x plus 20 is equal to 6x minus 24 right on further manipulation you will get 44 is equal to 2x which means x is equal to 22 now we have the constant of proportionality with us right the question is find the total number of students in the class right so if boys are 4x and girls are 3x then total number of students will become how much they will become 7x right and if x is equal to 22 number of students will become 7 into 22 which is 154 this means that there are total 154 students in this particular class